Hey, uh, this is Brian. I work as a rental technician at Gotham Sound, and today we're looking at the TX Advance app on this uh, Android tablet here. So what we've got is uh, full range RF scanning abilities mm -hmm. uh, using this little SDR dongle mm -hmm. uh, that we've got hooked up today to a Betso Bowtie antenna. Mm -hmm. And we've done a scan of the RF environment um, that is uh, prepared to deploy frequencies to our list of transmitters. So you put, so you put the list of transmitters in here. That's right. And, uh, and then it's scanned for you. Can we see it scan? Uh, the scanning itself is simply telling it to scan and then it runs for a minute or so um, within the range that I've set. The actual range that it'll scan I, goes up into the 900 range. Hmm. Wow. But for our talent wireless, I gave it the usual 470 to 608. Sure. And um, what it's got now is a reading of the, the RF quality, the noise floor for the frequencies that were already programmed. Mm -hmm. And it's telling me where I need to uh, you know, change frequencies for what I've already got going. Um, and getting new frequencies is as simple as doing an auto deployment. Now this is not actually deploying uh, frequencies, it's just telling you what you could use. That's right, that's right. So what I've got in the first two channels here are my shore transmitters and I've locked those frequencies um, because of shore's uh, syncing abilities. I want to control that stuff over on the receiver end. Mm -hmm. um, but if I were to unlock those it would give me clean frequencies here as well and then for the rest you can see uh, these frequencies all work well together f to avoid intermodulation. If there's any intermodulation problems, it lists them, mm -hmm. um, but it avoids them very uh, cleanly without a problem every time so far. And yeah, I've got perfectly executable frequencies for everything else. And uh, let me ask you, do you, like the, do you like it? I do. Yeah, it works uh, really smoothly. I found the interface really accessible from the start. I did not have to read a manual in order to start using it. Uh, it was, it was a uh, you know, process of simple deduction and hitting a couple buttons. Very cool. Right on. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome.